That's what NBC's Brian Gumbel asked Madonna in 1993. What did Dad think of sex? Of the book? Yeah. He hasn't seen it. He has to have heard about it. Of course he's heard about it, but he, it's not the kind of book my father would read. You know? It's not a book for everybody. <laughs> I think he'd like the book if he saw it. I don't think he would understand it, no. In order to like or dislike something, I believe you truly have to understand something. We'll have more of Brian's interview with Madonna on her fame, her family, and her future when Time and Again continues. In all the years I've been with this, Yes. I have, I have had the pleasure of doing a zillion one different people from all walks of life. My friends who know me have never asked to come out to any other interview. And yet for this one, doctors, lawyers, designers, friends, family, everybody wanted to come along. What is it about you people find so fascinating? I don't know. I think you should ask them. They just wanted to meet you. Mm -hmm. Does that happen all the time? Yeah, I guess. I mean, I'm sure there's plenty of people who don't want to meet me. I don't know. Doesn't strike you as bizarre or unusual? Well, I'm a celebrity, um, and I think a lot of people want to meet celebrities. Isn't that, isn't that how it works? Mm -hmm. I guess I'm in time. I, I, um, I also heard that you recently um, went home from the world. It's first time in two years. Well, first time in two years. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was weird. I'd sleep on the floor in a sleeping bag. You didn't sleep on the floor in a sleeping bag. <gasps> okay, I didn't sleep on the floor. I had to sleep on the floor in an air mattress, okay? That's just as bad. Seriously? <laughs> yeah. Is it hard when the whole family gets together and I mean, everybody in the family is family except for... Well, you know, when I go home, I, I don't get any sort of special treatment. And in a way, it's a relief. Yeah? Yeah. No. Do they still, I mean, just as they ever did, push you, hit you, yell at you, fight with you, scream at you, burn you? Nobody pushes me around anymore. Why did I am not surprised? <laughs> I think my brothers know better. I mean, my older brothers used to torture me, but I think all older brothers do that. They don't do that anymore. Are you still daddy's little girl? If you ever were. Oh, what does that mean? Daddy's little girl. Mm, daddies have a tendency to dote on their daughters, to always see their daughters in the, in the purest of terms, to always think the absolute best of them, to think they can do no wrong. Well, I think that's true to a certain extent. I, I have three other sisters, so I had to share that title, Daddy's Little Girl, with other, with other girls. Um, but I think that I'm still, you know, my father's daughter, which is, you know, he feels very protective of me, and... And um, certain elements of our relationship will never change, you know. He's the boss when I'm in his house. <laughs> and when you're not in his house? I'm the boss. Is he tough? Yes. In truth or dare, mm -hmm. when uh, Dad was going to come to the show, mm -hmm. we warned him about, hey, there's parts of the show you may be uncomfortable with. Right. <laughs> A couple of last questions. Um, you're a very young lady. Uh, what do you see yourself doing, let's say, 15 years from now? I have no idea. Oh, come on. You know, everybody has some idea. Maybe, maybe, maybe being retired and being... Uh, retired? Yeah. No way. No way? Retired doing what? Like gardening or something? What do you feel like doing? I, don't, I have no idea. Sex too? I don't know. No, I, I don't know what I'll be doing in 15 years. I just don't. If you could write the script, okay, for the next 10, 20 years, what's it include? Fanning George Brothers? What does it include? More free time. <laughs> Everything I read about you says that if you had a spare moment, you would try to read something to look for a script, that you would try to listen to a new group, that you would try to write something, that you would try to work on something, mm -hmm. that you are a compulsive worker and compulsively I am. ambitious. I am. I am. But on the other hand, I still want more free time. To do what? 
to have fun, to hang out, to do nothing, to read, to play dictionary with my friends, to, um, I don't know, be silly. Do you think that your fans will allow you to age with their blessing? It's not of my concern whether what my fans think of my age. It's not. That's not important. Being true to myself as an artist and being happy in life. That's important. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Madonna in January 1993.